Frosty Blue welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry, I I know I haven't been uploading lately and I'm so so sorry about that. But trying to find a new system to uh, to film uh gaming videos on uh, uh, my, my vlogging but also to do my gaming videos on and edit those better. Still working on that. But uh this video is not about that. Um so I don't know if anybody you know, you probably don't know, but um, if you follow me on Tumblr, Quatia Blue J on Tumblr, you can find me on Tumblr. Um, if you know from my Tumblr page, and if you don't know, I am a Yaoi fan. Woo! I have a Yaoi button too, and I just don't know where it is right now, but when I do, I'll find it for you. I am a giant Yaoi fan, and yeah, I know, judge me all you want, but I don't care. And, um, and I just, oh my god, I love it so much. So, um, sorry, my thought process sucks. So, I have watched, obviously, Junior Romantica. Um, and then, um, I also, oh my god, I can never pronounce this right. It's Hat, oh, Hatsuki, it's Hatsukui, Hatsukoi, damn it, you know what I mean. Uh, it's Sekai Ichi Hatsukoi. Ooh, I think I said it right. Oh, anyway. So, I've read, I've not, I've read and I've watched... Well, okay, I cannot say that. I have read part of Hatsukoi, and I've read very little of Jujo Romantica. Now you can judge me on that. Um, but I've watched all the anime. I did this forever ago. Like, when I found them that they were anime, I was just like, <gasps> give. So, um, I'm weird. Um, anyway, that's not what I want to talk about. Uh, uh, so, Love Stage. Whoever doesn't love, whoever doesn't know Love Stage should know Love Stage if you're in the Yaoi fandom. Um, okay, so I've read, I've read, and I'm keeping up with the series of Love Stage. It's not that long so far. Uh, hopefully there's, like, so much more, because there's just so much more to the story than there is now. And, um, so Love Stage is about Izumi, uh, Senna, and, uh, oh, God, Ryoma. Cannot think of his last name. Sorry, I just finished the anime. Uh, I'm kind of in a, I'm in a really good mood. Um, I, I didn't just, just finish the anime, and this is like, my, oh my god, this is my second or third time finishing it, all the way through, and, um, <coughs> I'm fangirling up in here, sorry about the squealing. Um, if I'm, oh, should really put a squealing warning at the beginning. Uh, this girl will fan, will fan, will fangirl scream. Um, I don't know what I'm, I'm trying to talk about. My my uh, my brain's all blah, 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 and uh, my mouth is all blah, 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 so it's a lot of blah, blah, blah. but um it's, it's like I'm saying blood da da it's weird um thought process sucks so I watched I watched Love Stage uh, I read the series I know there's more to it and I know they could have made more anime I'm hoping hoping to the anime gods they they make another season of Love Stage. As they do with Junior Romantica and Hatsukoi, because I really want that to happen. And, um, uh, anyway, so I, mean, I don't know what I want to talk about. Um, Love Stage, it's fantastic. Um, 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 I love Love Stage. That's very cheesy, but I don't care. It, oh, God. I love the characters so much because Izumi is uh, an otaku, and, um, oh my God, he loves this one character in this anime called Lala Lulu. And, uh, he's obsessed with her, and he has her body pillow, and he has all these, um, action figures. If you've seen the series, you know what I'm talking about. But he reminds me of me a little. Um, not as, as like the guy version of me, but w ten times cuter. Ten times. Like, a thousand times cuter than me. And, um, he, he reminds me of me, and I'm just like, it makes, it gives the otaku in me a lot of hope. And... I know, I know that's sad, I'm getting hope from an anime, but I don't care. You can get hope wherever you feel like getting hope from, and Love Stage give me, gives me that hope that I can fall in love too. Now, Ryoma, oh my god, he's gorgeous. I'm sorry, I I have the affinity to just fall in love with every anime boy, pretty boy in this, I, I know, I'm bad, but I, every, every anime pretty boy, I just cannot get over, because I just have this sort of way about them. I can't really describe it. I don't know what to say about it other than that they are fantastic. Now the main couple is my my utmost favorite so far, um, but 
I'm not saying that there's not any side couples. Of course, everybody knows that, spoiler alert, that Sugar and Ray are dating. Um, you know that from the manga backstage. You get the also the, gl- the glitch from the, um, not the glitch, the uh, hint from the anime series. It's a very slight one. And um, and in the manga series, love stage as well. Um, they, they did a manga called Backstage about Ray and Shugo, but it wasn't really a... It didn't explain the story at all. It kind of got, well, from the website I was reading it from, it kind of got cut off, and it really didn't explain anything about Shogo and Ray's relationship. But that needs to happen. I need a backstage anime to go on with Shogo and Ray, with intermediates with Izumi and Ryoma. Be awesome. Um, so that's that. I also wanted to talk about the side characters in the series. Now, some of the, not the obvious, not always the obvious side characters, but the ones I found really interesting. I wrote it down here. <coughs> so some of the side characters I really was really curious about was uh, Kirai. Oh my god. I don't spell his name. I cannot pronounce his name. Um, Kurio? Kurio? If you know who I'm talking about, it's uh, Izumi Sana's friend in Manga Club. It's the skinny one. Uh, the other skinny one in the Manga Club. Uh, he, you find up later in the series, spoilers, uh, that he is Satsume Sensei, which is Lala Lulu's creator's assistant. And, um, and Senna's like, oh my god! So, yeah, I'm like, there was Senna. But, um, his story, I want to know. I want to know what Kirai's story is. It's K-U-R-O-I. I know I'm pronouncing it wrong. I don't care. His side, I want to know what his side story is. Because he's, he's tiny, he's cute, he's, he's like the other Izumi, um, in, in the series. And, um... And you might think, oh my god, he's like, he's boring, there's nothing really about him. You got a mysterious part-time job you don't know about and probably until the last episode of the series. No, it's on the last episode of the series. You don't find out who his part-time job is until the end of the series. Um, oh my god. Oh, you know what I mean. Um, I forgot where I was going with this. I forgot so much. Um... I would love to see the Kurai and Satomi Sensei series. Now, it doesn't implicate in the series that they're dating, but the way Satomi Sensei treats Kurai in that one scene above, like when, um, when Shugo, Rei, Ryoma, and Izumi go to, go to, um, the park in, I think it's in the OVA, when they go to the amusement park and Satomi Sensei is there and Kurai is there because Lala Lulu's having like a stage kind of stage play going on and Karai taking pictures and whatever and you get a glimpse of them but the, the way they react and the way they uh, behavior between them just kind of suggests that I know it's probably the only girl inside of me that is suggesting that but it'd be really cool I would love love a Kurai and Satomi sensei story just a short one it doesn't have to be long um but I, I'm really curious about them I'm also curious about the company president president of B Dash, which is Ryoma's president. Sorry, my nose is clogged. Um, which is Ryoma's advisor or president, and I don't know what his name is, and his assistant. Because the way they act against each other, like again, the way they treat each other, you know, he's um, his assistant is the calm one, and the president is all mean and whatever. If you watch the anime, you know who I'm talking about. But um. So they kind of go together, like, they're two pieces of a pod. And the way, at the, I don't see what episode was it. It was, like, episode eight or whatever. When they were, I mean, like, when they looked at each other, I was just like, yes. Probably, I was like, yet again, probably the yaoi girl inside of me that's screaming. They're probably yaoi, because I think every yaoi, every male couple bromance is probably yaoi. Sorry, once you get on the yaoi train, you cannot get off. It's just like, you cannot get off this train at all. So I want to see, I kind of want to see like a branch of that too, because you're just like, it's like this couple would, would be really interesting, you know? It reminds me of uh, Nowaki and, um, oh, what was it? Nowaki and Hori. Hori? Hori. Oh, don't, don't hurt me for this. Um, Hero! Hero! Ha! I got it. Nowaki and Hiro-san. And uh, it kind of reminds me of them and how their relationship works. Um, so I kind of want I want a side story for them. And I also want a side story for, um, I want a better side story of Shuku and Rei. Because you only get indications, you don't get anything solid, nothing really goes on between them other than work during the uh, Love Stage anime. And I want more. I want more Shuku and Rei. 
give it to me. Thank you. All right. That's side characters to talk about. Love, love to see that. Because I'm really curious about all these characters. Okay. Um. What? Well, I think it was totally fang. I think I've calmed myself down now. Whew. Calm myself down. But yes, if you haven't seen Love Stage, I probably spoiled most of the series to you. I'm sorry. But if you want to know what I'm talking about, go watch Love Stage. I found it on YouTube. It's on kissanime.com too. It's on Otaku Center. It's on... It's everywhere. Basically, if you know how to use the damn internet, you can find it. Um, basically. So, um, I'm going to watch the OVA now, again, for the third time. Because um, I love it. Because it's just really funny. And um, if you have not seen Love Stage, you should. If you have not seen Junior Romantica, you should. If you haven't seen Hatsukoi, you should do it. Um, if you're not a Yaoi fan, I'm going to make you a Yaoi fan because it's fantastic. Um, I know, I'm, I'm fangirling right now, but I just, I wanted to get it out of my system. And I wanted to talk to you guys because I haven't talked to you guys in a while. And sorry. And now I'm calm. I know I'm calm and I'm really happy. Uh, this, these, this couple, these couples in this series are <clears throat> more confirmed a couple of Izumi and Ryuma. It just made me really happy, um, cause Izumi realizes his feelings for Ryuma, Ryuma realizes his feelings for Izumi before Izumi, but I don't care! They're together! It makes me happy! Um, they're in love, they're young, they have time, they have space, they have potential! It's fantastic! It's hope! I have no hope in my life. Give me this hope. Um, I know how the manga series goes. It's still updating. If you haven't read the manga series of Love Stage, you should. Uh, I go to mangahere.com. They have, um, oh my god. They have, <laughs> they have, ant they have manga on there. And giant yaoi section. I read all of that. Mo majority of that section I have read. Um, they keep adding more and they keep finding more yaoi mangas and keep putting them on there. There's, of course, you know, there's not just yaoi manga in there. There's yuri manga and there's all kind of manga in there. Um, but I think Manga Here is one of the best websites ever. I have an app called, I think it's called Amazing Manga. I don't know where my phone is. I have an app called Amazing Manga. When I'm, it's 2.30 in the morning and I want to watch, I, I want to read yaoi. I go to that app and Manga Here is listed and, um, so I, I read that. I'm not an advertising for them. I'm just saying it's good. So I feel better. <laughs> Thank you for listening to my rambling fangirlness. My nose is clogged for some reason. Face. Um. So yeah. And if you don't follow me on Tumblr, you should. Oh my God. No, I'm kidding. You shouldn't. Um, I'm not really that active on Tumblr. Um. I really can't say that. Um. I was active last night. I'm on Tumblr from time to time. I don't really post all that many things when I do. I talk about my life here at school. Um, and then I do like supernatural gifs and um, friend gifs and basically any fan of my Venom gifs. Uh, usually the gifs just explain my life through pictures. Pictures with a thousand words, right? Yeah. I can't wait. Don't. Yeah. Anyway, um, so if you're not a Yaoi fan, become a Yaoi fan and watched all three of those and there's more than that in the anime world um close the last door is another one um what's that one with that guy it has the oh my god beautiful blonde boy and he's skinny and he has the biggest bluest eyes ever i think it's i think it's called no money um i don't know what the japanese equivalent to that is um but, I mean, like, you can easily find the manga, because the guy is, like, huge, and the other guy is just tiny, and he's so cute, though, oh my god, and he, the guy treats him like a hamster, oh, anyway, me and Yaoi, I like this, um, so I am done rambling, I'm hoping this has not been too long, thank you for watching, if you didn't watch, oh well, if you're new to my channel, this is doesn't really usually happen, but it really should because I have a lot of yaoi, uh, well not a lot of yaoi, but I have a lot of anime energy, uh, knowing. So, uh, doing, no, I'm not sure why I'm doing this, and, um, if you're new to my channel, this is part of my craziness, not half the time. Sometimes I'm just like this, uh, most of the, uh, some of the time I, I would like to think I'm like this, um, you know, there are no words to describe me. Um, Sam sounded like Chandler there a little bit, tiny bit. Okay, I'm done rambling. 
Be good, be safe, be happy. I love you, my Blue Jays. If you're new to my channel, please watch the rest of my videos because they're amazing. And hopefully I'm going to start to try new games. Um, I don't know. I might do Happy Wheels again. I don't know. We'll see. I have I had time. I might not have time. I've had papers due this week. Stuff has happened. Okay? Be good, be safe, be happy. I love you, my Blue Jays. Bye.